historical day. Historical day. It's crazy to think about. Let me do some thoughts, man. We are passing O'Fallon. See that white tower up there? I'm in the Midwest. I'm in Missouri. O'Fallon, Missouri, I believe. Um, it's crazy how we come from an idea to where we are now. Fall 2010 was really the outbreak of the whole movement. It really was. Um, did seven schools, whatever, seven schools, seven different states. You know, went as far as the East Coast. And uh, this year is the beginning. And um, I believe I have the best job in the world. Who else can go travel state to state and go visit some young men to help them become successful individuals at the highest level? It's a lifetime commitment. It's a lifetime commitment. And um, my job is to articulate it to the rest of the world as we make uh, my goal, one of my goals, I have many goals. Uh, one of my big goals is to make uh, mentoring the national and global obsession. You know what I mean? With different, with different sectors who want to help, you know, all kids. But we're going to have to break them down. And uh, I want to break them down into uh, in the groups. And the community college student athlete is a big group. So we're left out, stigmatized, disenfranchised. You know what I mean? That's what it is. You know, there's a stigma on JC athletes. So it's a part of me, you know, being an overachiever is to change that stigma. You know, I'm a former scholarship athlete. Actually, I'm a forever scholarship athlete. We changed that. I'm a graduate school. Successful individual. I'm a black male. So I'm going to push that. I'm going to push that life. I'm going to push that movement of uh, these young men pursuing graduate degrees, whether that be graduate or doctorate. I mean, it's all graduate, but the more of us that have them, we win. I'm a winner, so there's something inside of me that that refuses to be mediocre. And I'm working on it every day, every single day. Be mindful of the dream every day, every hour, every minute, every second. It's not easy, it's hard work. It's hard work being this, um, being this cool, man. And I'm gonna tell you this, man. There's people that support me, you know, in many ways. Might not necessarily be financial, but people that got my back. I, I love all of them. Um, from a financial aspect, you know, there's a few people that look out for me, and I appreciate them. Gorgeous and gorgeous. She knows who she is. I keep her identity cool, you know, because I know where we're going. But uh, it's all out of my own pocket. This is God giving me. This is heaven sent. I was born to do this. Period. Born to do this, man. Identify mental health uh, issues that inter interrupt academic success, athletic success, social success, uh, spiritual success. It's holistic, man. It's my program. You know, period. I got more form. I got more information in the game. Pop got records, you know what I mean? If you could, if you could switch it you know, to an analogy, I'm not sure I have time. Keep a five minute burst. Um, if you could flip it in an analogy of a uh, rap artist, you know, historical rap artists, they have songs, I have information. I'm gonna translate it. This is a new movement. Does it happen like this before? It won't happen like this again. I'm changing everything changing everything. So uh, I'm going to get out of here in about 20 seconds. Like I said, I'm driving to Marshall, Missouri. I'm going to keep saying it. This has never been done before. Tell me the last time you find somebody from anywhere other than parents, loved ones, start from a JC. How many JCs have a, have a director of mentorship that goes out to see the kids after they transfer from the JC? Nobody's paying them. It's untouchable, bro. 
from a brat and boast this trip. I need to. That's real, but you know, without a all the way, all the time. <laughs>